Here's Beaky, well in lead two, Berry haven't given up an automatic place quite yet as Clayton Donaldson goes through and scores for Birmingham City, Alex Crook. Yeah, but Bournemouth nil, Birmingham won 18 minutes on the clock, not what the Cherries wanted or needed. It was a long punt up field by Birmingham, Clayton Donaldson so dangerous on the counter-attack in between the two central defenders, he lifted the ball over Arthur Borat to come off his line. It's Bournemouth nil, Birmingham won. That's my boy. That's my boy, Clayton Donaldson. That's what we brought him from Brentford to do. Terrific calmness to lob it over Boris. Didn't just put his laces through it, did he? Guided it over the keeper. And that's exactly what I've been talking about, Alex. Birmingham on the counter, looking threatening. Cook and Elphick in between the two of them. And a super finish to boot. Oh, it was a wonderful finish. And you can see what it means to Birmingham fans to our left-hand side. They yeah, were the can't you? St Andrews humiliated and forlorn after 8-0 thrashing. And I think a bit of revenge has just been served. I told you, it's a revenge mission here today, I can tell you that. I was about to tell you down in League 2, Berry haven't given up on an automatic promotion spot. Four points off third at the start of the day. They have the lead against Morecambe uh, up at Gig Lane. Looks like Tom Eve's got the final touch on that goal. And uh, let's get off to Carrow Road, see if there's been any sign of a breakthrough between Norwich and Sheffield Wednesday. Paul McVay and Tony Incenzo. Yes. Well, the Birmingham City fans said, we want eight. They're a quarter of the way there. Alex Crook. Incredible. Bournemouth nil, Birmingham two. And this is just as good a goal as the opener from Clayton Donaldson. That was all about finesse. This was all about skill and pace from David Cottrell down the right-hand side. He twisted and teased his way past Charlie Daniels. Charlie Daniels oh, has made word. it. Bournemouth four, Birmingham two. Surely now the points are safe. And Daniels, who was at fault in the first half, perhaps, for the goal scored by Cottrell he's hammered the ball in there off the underside of the crossbar on the half volley and surely now Bournemouth are going back to the top of the table Bournemouth 4, Birmingham 2